I am Anil Kumar and with the help of this very general question, we will get to know a very important thing on optimization. The question here is, show that the square is the rectangle with maximum area for fixed perimeter. You will come across many questions where we are given the perimeter. We say perimeter is fixed. So we say P is fixed. Perimeter is what? It is sum of length and width of a rectangle, right? So let us say we have a rectangle in general. So when we say perimeter is fixed, that means constant, then it is normally equals to 2 length plus 2 width, right? Now if perimeter is fixed, then we can always write one dimension in terms of the other. So we say 2 length is equals to perimeter minus 2 width or length is equals to perimeter minus 2 width divided by 2. So we get length in terms of width and perimeter where we know perimeter is constant. Constant or fixed, right? Now what is area? Area is length times width. So now we know length in terms of width will substitute P minus 2W over 2 for length times width. So what we get here is an expression which is only in W. So we can write this as area in terms of as a function of width. You get the point, right? Now here, if I multiply this, then what do I get? I get PW over 2, let me write them separately, minus 2 and 2 cancel W square. So that is an expression which we will get. Now the question is, show that the square is the rectangle with maximum area for fixed perimeter. Now if perimeter is fixed, then length and width, how are they related? We can say that width can maximum be equal to perimeter and least it will be zero. So those are the boundary conditions for the width. The other one we can found we can find using derivative, right? So we can equate derivative of area to zero to get our critical number, right? So let's find the critical number now. So a let's write a w equals to p w over two where p is constant w square so a dash rate of change of area with width will be p over 2 minus 2w, right? And this is 0. That means p over 2 minus 2w should be equal to 0. From here we can solve for w. We have 2w equals to p over 2 or width is equals to p over 4. Now if width is p over 4, what is length? Let's find out. Length is equals to perimeter minus 2 times width. Width is P over 4, right? Divided by 2. So which is equals to P minus P over 2 divided by 2, right? So that is half P. So that is P over 2 divided by 2 or P over 4. So what we notice is both length and width are same. So that means the structure is a square, right? So what we get is for maximum area, width equals to one fourth of perimeter and length is also equals to one fourth of perimeter. So since both those sides are equal, it is a square. So in general, for any given rectangle with fixed perimeter, if you need to find what are the dimensions of the rectangle for maximum area, the answer is square. One fourth of perimeter is the side of your square. I hope that helps. Thank you.